Hello everybody, so today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is the integral. We have the integral of x minus 5 over x squared multiplied with x plus 1 dx. So I will show you the technique, how to answer the question. In here, we add number 1, so we need to minus number 1. Negative 1, negative 5, you got about negative 6. S plus 1 divided to S plus 1, you will got about two integrals in here. The first one, that's about the S over S square. And the second one, that's about negative 6. Multiply with the integral of the S over S square. Multiply with s plus 1. We know that the integral of the s over s square, you will got about negative 1 over s. And now we need to carry about the second integral in here. For this integral in here, we can use about integration by trigonometric substitution so we move about s equal to 10 t square d s equal to 2 10 t d t over cosine t square now we need to change this one s we change for 10 t square S square we change to 10 to the power of 4 t. The S we change for this one. Next, we have 1, one plus 10 t square equal to 1 over, over cosine t square. So, in this one, we change for 1 over cosine t square. Cosine t square multiply with cosine t square in here. So, they will simplify together. We have 10 t and 10 to the power of 4. They simplify together. 6 multiply with number 2, we got about 12. And we just got only dt over 10 t to the power of 3. So we have the second formula 10 t equal to sat over cos t. In here, we get about cos t to the power of 3. And in here, we have psi t to the power of 3. Next, about cos t to the power of 3, we separate them into cos t. And we have cos t to the power of 2. We have the formula. Cos t square plus psi t square equal to number 1. So we change cos t square in here into 1 minus psi t square. So we can use about integration by substitution. So we put about u equal to psi t du of which change to z dz equal to cos t dt. 
and now we change for this one size t we change for z to the power of 3 size this way we change to z to the power of 2 for size t dt we change to dz So in here, we can uh, have the integral of 1 over z square z number 3, sorry and we have z square divided to z to the power of 3 you will got about negative 1 over z about z to the power of 3 we can change z to the power of negative number 3 so we have the negative 12 the integral of z to the power of negative 3 you got about z to the power of negative 3 plus 1 over negative 3 plus 1 and uh, this one we change to ln of the absolute value of z and we have c is about constant this one we change to negative number 2 this is about negative number 2 so we multiply in here negative 12 divided to negative 2 you got about 6 over z to the power of 2 minus because we have negative, negative, so you got about positive. Now we need to change the value of z into s. About z, we change to sati. About t, we change back for s. So let's see this one. We put the square root in the both side and we got about t equal to r times the square root of s. And that's it about the final answer. This is the end. Thank you for watching.